All right, welcome to Smoking Approved Korea. I'm your boy, Journalist, and on this one, we are here to check out Shy Shy MFBTY uh, featuring EE, e., Dino J, and Rap Monster. Uh, this is what Tiger JK and his bird featuring uh, RM, I believe, is how this was pitched to me. Uh, thank you guys very much for your time and just participating in this journey that I'm going through. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. If you could please hit that like, subscribe, Patreon's in the description. Let's get into this one and see what we got. I see you on the east side. Shorty don't got micro braids, do she? That's what this sounds like. It sounds like that Chris Brown record. How you gonna even hate? You can't even get in. I can already tell everybody on this song has decided to just have a good time. And not take themselves too seriously. Because I'm approaching this with far too serious of a mind state currently. Because I'm just like, this man say any, meeny, miny, mo. And I want to flame him for it. But I, I can't. Because I don't actually understand what the hell I'm consuming right now. I'm so lost. I'm so lost. I don't know what the hell is going on. She got like a sexy female rap voice like Eve. Y'all remember Eve? Eve. Yo, Eve used to be hard. Hard. I used to love Eve. Little pretty self. Man. Eve was like one of my super rap crushes when I was a little nigga. Like, psh. It's Eve. Oh, that's just she had Gwen Stefani, that whole little Eve era. I mean, you know how many girls got paw prints right here because of Eve? Eve is an icon. Wow. I couldn't watch that TV show she had with Brandy, though. At that point, I, I was I was too grown at that point. Her uh, nostalgia crush wave had for sure worn off on me. So had Brandy's, because I couldn't watch that. But I sure did love Brandy in the game. I don't know if y'all know about the game. I love the game. Y'all seen the new season of the game? I know that it just sounds like I'm just saying the game a bunch of times, but it's really a TV show. <laughs> it's really good. Matter of fact, I'm going to just start it over, because it's that good. I just started the game over like two, three times. I'm sorry. This is just, this is divulged into a tangent that is not helping anything. I'm fucking undefeated. They want to take my spot. Mad cause I'll never stop. Mad cause I'm hot too hot. I'll always finish up on top. To my name, I'm copy pro, but I'm a good thing. 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 I'm they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to have it, they want to grab it, they want to
got pain now by rap how What is what am I saying? What is it? Lunas. Lunas. With the Hungs and the Nunas who are in the albums I bought. Nunas got to be like what you call like an older sister in context. I feel like y'all already told me this and my brain is fixing, like connecting that information. But Hung and Nunas got to be like an older female artist that has worked in the same industry as you. And they've just been doing it a little bit longer. Ajushi? Who's the... Ajushi got to be doing big things in the real estate market in Korea. All right, sir. I did not expect this one bit from you. You're rapping too fast, my brother. I'm, I'm sorry. I need to read what you're saying. since middle school it's so strange to see i don't even want to call it appropriation i just it's just strange to see hairstyles that i naturally would see on black women on some of these asian women that i've seen in uh we'll say korea k-pop j-pop just anybody that's not just an american black female or just an african woman honestly because like micro braids like ah fuck, what's that name Oh, because this is what pops in my head when I see them now. I, I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all just so you guys can get on my wavelength. I ain't forgot. Forget. I ain't forget about those micro braids. This is as soon as I seen it. It's in this one. But where is it at, though? Because I'm not about to see it. Make y'all just sit through all this, but I know it's in here. No, come on, yeah, there we go, there we go. Hey, this nigga hilarious though. I love this nigga. I ain't forget. You used to you used to wear jeans. Had all the basketball teams on it. Thirty two basketball teams. He be cooking niggas. This nigga hilarious. You bought that on what? I was right here. You about that micro break? Uh, all the colors for you can do activity. And I'm sure. Hoping. Fixing cars. You almost got chilled, but you ran. And I'm sure. <laughs> you almost got chilled, but you, you ran. Hey, forget about that micro break. Uh-uh. You just swing your whole check on them. Oh, uh, y'all can't see it because it's got the thing. Uh, why does it go away? How do you make that go away? But yeah, this is what I see in my head. Put them in your head for hours. They look like stitches in your head. You had blue, 
and maroon sketches. Then you ah, oh, that's terrible. Can I just actually see it the proper one? Never forget compilation. Oh, that's not fair. It's not fair. I ain't forget about them. I ain't forget about them. That nigga hilarious. I love watching that nigga. He's funny. But that's what I, I think of when I seen her with these individuals. I was like, what is what do we what? Good for good. Oh. However, she could rap like a motherfucker. She could rap. Everybody on here could rap. And then to get back to the song, because I've totally been distracted by it. This seems like a collaboration between multiple generations and then also a like a snub towards those people that just have not been taking the craft seriously, that don't actually have the diligence to really stay on path to make what it is to be like a rapper, like stick and turn into something. But that's just for me. And it's like uh, homage verses. Like everybody is being very respectful of each other. Or like in Arms verse, he's talking about how like he's just kind of shy to rap on this song with these people that he would consider legends in his book. And he gets to do a song with these people. So... That's pretty much what I've taken from the song. I don't know what the buku, uh, I don't know what that is. It, uh, like the arrangement and a lot of the things on this song, I'm just like, this sounds so crazy to me. Like, this sounds like um, mid 2010s hip hop, but like mixed with 1990s like boom bap principles. That's kind of how this sounds and feels to me. But I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. Uh, thank you very much for your time. Please do hit the like, subscribe. Patreon's in the description. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.